Hello everybody and welcome to a lovely episode of Buy My Jet. This week I fixed the lighting I think. I'm not really sure if it really works but I love this setup. It has our little background here and then for Christmas we're gonna have a little wine themed Christmas tree over in the corner because why not? I love that pun. Anyway, um, so this week's wine is a suggested wine, which is uh, awesome. I love when you guys suggest wines for me. So this is going to be Yellowtail's Pink Moscato. Now, the Pink Moscato was a bit hard for me to find. I don't know how it was hard for me to find because it's common. Yellowtail's common. But my local liquor store didn't have that bottle, so I'm like, all right. I traveled 30 minutes out of my way to get this wine. And all they had was the one and a half liter bottle. So I'm hoping this is good enough where I'm going to want the whole one and a half liters. I think it will be given its yellow tail, so we're going to assume it's going to be great. So let's go ahead and open this. It's a lovely twist top wine, so I'm excited about that. No need to get a corkscrew or anything. That's the wonderful thing about yellow tail is their wines are always um, screw tops. And they're budget friendly, so who doesn't love a good wine that's budget friendly and... Doesn't take a long time. Let's see. Ooh, it smells sweet, like pineapples in there. Oh my god, I'm smelling this, and I'm already, I'm already loving it. I haven't even poured a glass, so let's go ahead and pour a little bit of glass. A little bit here. Ooh, that looks delicious. Okay, I'm excited for this now. It smells amazing, so I know I'm gonna love this wine. Um, I'll read the back of the bottle after we've tasted it. So give her a little wine, a little swirl. Ooh, it's a little frothy. Hmm, okay. Okay. Um, that's good. Holy moly. Oh, I like that. So yeah, uh, this was worth the um, $9 I paid for it. I'm excited about this. One and a half liters of wine for nine ninety. I think it was nine ninety five or something like that. Anyway, either way, I like this wine. I'm trying to figure out what the fruit is though that's in this because it's a really potent fruit. It's a melon. Um, I want to say honeydew melon. Let me read the back of this because I'm not really getting much off the flavor palette. It, zingy. Okay, they use the word zingy. I was thinking that as well. Bursting with ripe... Oh, it's green apple. Oh, definitely not a melon. Apple's not a melon. Oh my God, but strawberry and apple. This is strawberry and apple. You guys know me. Um, I will link the commenter who suggested this above here. Thank you for this wine suggestion because you just picked a wine that's like right up my alley. It's zingy, it's fruity, it's sweet. I think this is my new favorite Yelltail. Honest, honestly, I love the regular Moscato, the white Moscato, but this pink Moscato, this is pink Moscato, right? Yeah, pink Moscato. This might be my new favorite wine, and this might be the right size wine bottle. So I'm super glad I bought this one. Um, yeah. Oh my gosh. So good, guys. I definitely think you should check this out. If you're on a budget and you want some wine, get Yellowtail Pink Moscato. Now, I'm sure these smaller bottles are a little cheaper, like six something, maybe ish, six dollars, some change. But you're going to want the one and a half liter bottle telling you it's worth the nine dollars i will be drinking this bottle for at least a week because i can't have the whole bottle in one day and it will take about maybe two people to finish the bottle so wow another winner thank you so much for the wine suggestion i really appreciate that so so good um am i gonna rate this obviously i'm giving it a nine out of ten it's that good i mean yeah, if now, um, if it was a, if this was a smaller bottle, you know I'd be finishing the bottle. But it's a one and a half liter bottle, so we ain't finishing this bottle. I may have a few more, a couple of glasses of this, you know, later on today, but oh my. This to me, though, screams like a dessert wine. It doesn't really say so. I don't know what I would have this with for a main en entree. Maybe like a chicken dish, but if you're going to have this wine, I'm thinking go dessert wise. Just because it has the so much fruity, sugary flavors to it that if you were to pair it with like a main entree, well actually you could. You could pair it with a salad. 
Oh my God, yeah, a salad. Guys, have a salad with this wine. Oh my God, yes, be healthy, have a salad. Um, I think Dole, um, the brand Dole, they make a salad kit. I think it's called Endless Summer. And it has like a sesame ginger um, honey or whatever sauce, or dressing rather, not sauce, dressing. This would probably go good with that. Oh my God, yeah, do that. Have a salad. Have a salad and some wine, guys. Have yourself a wine tasted Wednesday with a salad and wine. Why not, right? Anyways, thank you so much for watching this lovely wine review video. Hopefully it helped you pick out your wine choices for the week or the night or the day. Um, I do really appreciate the wine suggestions. So guys, if you have any more wine suggestions for me, comment below. I'd love to hear some suggestions. And this was a fantastic one, so spot on. Um, yeah, please do hit like if you like this video. Um, um, any suggestions, other suggestions or anything in general you want to say to me? comment below. I will return to your comment in a timely fashion. And if you want to hit subscribe, please do so. I post at least once a week, or I try to anyway. And if you want to hit the bell for notifications, it'll show up and tell you when I post a video on this channel. And that about wraps up our little lovely review. So thanks for watching, and you have an awesome Wine Tastic Wednesday. Bye guys!